Hey, welcome to Vancouver on this rainy overcast day. Um, just wanted to do a quick video blog. We don't have Skype up and running, well we don't have internet up and running in the apartment, so no Skype, no emails, all that sort of stuff. The best you can do is Wix Cafe, a wonderful coffee shop nearby that has free Wi-Fi. Uh, can't really Skype during a coffee shop, so this is the next best thing. Um, by now you guys should have seen the tour of the apartment. Uh, if you haven't, go watch that now. I'll wait right here. Are you back? Okay. That was pretty quick. Uh, so yeah, so you've seen the couch that you guys can crash on when you come over. Uh, it's really comfy, it's really nice, it falls out into you know, a, a comfortable size. Um, and it's free to you guys. Great, right? Uh, just make sure you book in because we do have a lot of people looking to come over, especially over the summer. So we don't want too much of a clash. Uh, we do have a rather large floor, so if you want to borrow, borrow sleeping bags or whatever, you know, we can do that. But, you know, let's try to keep it friendly. We don't want people ending up having to stay in the hostel and kind of being out of the way. That said, Vancouver is not a million miles away. Downtown is like a 10 minute bus drive um, or on the SkyTrain. Uh, that's the public transport system, which is spectacular. It's amazing. Um, so, Vancouver. We've been here about two weeks now. We've been in the apartment about a week um, and we're loving it. It's amazing. Uh, similarities between Ireland and Vancouver are probably the weather. It begins and ends there. Uh, it is not very cold. In fact, it's probably warmer in Ireland. Definitely a night warmer in Ireland. We pretty much leave the windows open every night because it's just so, so warm. Uh, like I said today, pretty rainy, pretty overcast, pretty Irish. Um, but the differences are just blow everything else out of the water. The city itself is pretty small. I mean, you know, it's nice because I don't get lost in it and I get lost easy. Uh, but you know, it, it, it's a great city. The first thing you'll probably spot if you haven't been here before are the cars. It's just, they just have the most amazing cars. They have, there's Porsches everywhere, there's Mustangs, there is, you know, all these fantastic cars that you have never see in Ireland. Really, really nice. And they're everywhere. I mean, it's not like you'll see one or two, you'll just, they're everywhere. Um, the food is just spectacular. I mean, you eat out, you get the best service, you get the best food, um, and it's cheap. It's like, you know, like twelve dollars will feed feed both myself and Claire. You know, really, really well. Especially when it comes to sushi, or Japanese food. There are so many sushi places in, in Vancouver that they're all competing against each other, and you end up getting really, really cheap, really good food with big portions. Um, and it's healthy, right? I mean, you know, myself and Claire have gotten so much healthier. And so so much fitter over the last couple of days. I mean, you know, whether you want to or not, Vancouver will make you fit. You walk everywhere. Everybody walks everywhere. Uh, we're definitely planning on buying bicycles and planning on buying bicycles and going cycling around the place. Um, really looking forward to that. So yeah, that's that's Vancouver. Look, I'm not going to waffle on too long. I want to keep this nice and short. Um, but looking forward to having Skype and uh, looking forward to getting back to talk to you guys proper. Uh, you know, actually get some conversation going. For now, video blogs for the next couple of days. I'll see what I can what I come up with. Um, yeah. Slow on. See you guys around.